Hello everyone, I am Dr. Meghna Iskumar, Consultant Pediatric and General Dentist, Indiana Hospital, Mangalore. Pediatric Dentistry, what is Pediatric Dentistry? Pediatric Dentistry is an age-defined speciality which provides preventive, primary, comprehensive and therapeutic healthcare needs to children through adolescence, including the ones with special healthcare needs. Special healthcare needs means children who are suffering from Down syndrome, cerebral palsy or any other abnormalities are also treated by the pediatric dentist. Let me talk about the preventive aspects of pediatric dentistry. In preventive aspects, you have two important things that is the fluoride and the pit and fissure sealants. Fluoride is a very very helpful chemical in dentistry. We do something called as a tropical fluoride application where we apply fluoride on the surface of the tooth because of which the structure of the tooth will change to something called as a fluorapatite that will help to prevent your teeth not to decay so that it makes your teeth more resistant to decay. And what is this pit and fissure sealants? Usually when the teeth comes into the oral cavity, they have on their surface deep pits and fissures where your food goes and accumulates because of which there is bacterial contamination and decay will happen. But if you seal those pit and fissure sealants with the sealants, they will prevent the food accumulation and hence prevent decay. So fluoride and pit and fissure sealants are the two important aspects that are involved in the preventive aspects of pediatric dentistry. Now let me tell you the importance of primary teeth, why primary teeth is important. Primary teeth will guide your permanent teeth into the correct space into the oral cavity. So if the primary teeth are lost at a young age due to extraction or decay, permanent teeth won't know where to erupt and they will erupt haphazardly causing crowding of the teeth. And any decay in the primary teeth can cause discoloration of the permanent teeth leading to something called as hypoplasia in the permanent teeth. Now let me talk about trauma in the early or the young permanent teeth. So if there is a trauma in the young permanent teeth that needs to be handled either by apexification or apexogenesis because the tooth root won't be formed and if the tooth is dead or necrotic it has to be dealt with apexification and if you have a vital tooth it has to be dealt with apexogenesis and if the teeth is lost at an early age you have something called as a space maintainers in pediatric dentistry that will maintain the space of the primary teeth so as a pediatric dentist i would request you to schedule your child's visit within six months of age that is as soon as the primary central incisors lower erupts and then continue your treatment with a pediatric dentist because they know the psychology of the child they know behavioral management of the child and they will handle your child in a better way so that the fear of dentistry will be taken away from the child thank you one and all indiana hospital and heart institute aid inspire aspire